everybody. <laughs> Happy Sunday. The whole goal of these shows is to be as relaxed and interpersonal as possible. I can hear you, I can see you. It's a really beautiful thing. We haven't had a chance to play live music in a normal scenario in quite a long time now. And so um, my goal with bringing this whole aesthetic is I wasn't, I really wasn't quite ready to play out. And so this is my way of being comfortable. I'm gonna be chilling on this couch playing music for you guys, and uh, I'm just so grateful to be here, and thank you guys so much for uh, supporting me, and uh, I'm really excited to be next to you guys. Um, as part of that vibe, I, I don't write any set lists, and uh, we're just gonna kinda go with the flow and see what comes out, right? Now I'm on the road, I'm knowing not which way to go. Is it yes or is it no? The golden sun has washed me away and I've become just another vagabond holding my hand. Oh. And, uh, this past year, I've actually listened to more music than I have in a long time. You'd be surprised, with touring with the band, uh, you know, that's a lot of fucking music <laughs> at once. And uh, a lot of times I'll spend my downtime like playing my Nintendo Switch and skateboarding and just doing things that are not music so I can kind of put all the music, you know, juice I have into the into the performance at night. And so uh, a kind of a, a silver lining of the pandemic was rediscovering my joy of just listening to music as an activity. And uh, I don't know about you guys, but I found in this digital age, it can be hard sometimes to find the patience to just relax enough to listen to music as an experience. And what I mean is not while you're scrolling on your phone, like just sit down with either headphones or through a speaker and listen to music. And it's a whole... It's like it's, it's almost like an, an experience of nostalgia I had when I when I was able to rediscover that, and uh, it's been a beautiful thing in that.
Try 